child. She would sleep under a full moon, believing it feasts on clouds to inflate in size, shutting her eyes like closing blinds, only to put the moon back into her mouth like a jawbreaker. Twirling her tongue on its craters, the moon was literally full, and the world was never hungry. She'd wake up on the bend of the bed, on the curve of the world with a dream of living many different lives. One for each day, one for each half day, one life to brush her teeth and another life swaying to the beat of her last life's heart. Every birthday she would make the same wish. Let me eat clouds like the moon. Wish one, make me a photographer. Two, an astronaut. Three, a doorknob. Four, she asks for a science kit fit to be a scientist, hoping she would find the cure for cancer so no one else would have to be fed soup through a half-crooked smile. In a body weak enough to disintegrate before it dies, sheesh. I learned the word condition. Realized people were dictionaries, life a walking definition. Feelings a carefully constructed sentence placed on a timeline. These phrases became the drilling sounds at construction sites in between every bone of my ribcage. The unescapable pouring of cement at 8 a.m. Turns out the moon was just transitioning in lunar phases. It made me forget the clouds. The stars glued to my ceiling. They are plastic, 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 and they are falling off. I started, being, I started being forced to morph into a contortionist. Arms closing in on themselves in awkward positions until my knees and elbows confused themselves, claustrophobic by these definitions and facts. Love definition. A strong feeling of affection. Pain definition, highly unpleasant physical sensation, anxiety definition, disorder. But love, love is the courage to dance with your shoelaces untied. It is our hands getting lost in the numbness of being held until I confuse your hand with mine. Pain is accumulation, like a hundred laundry pins attached to skin. When one pin is a laugh in a hundred, become a panic attack. Anxiety is breakfast. It gets stuck between the tightest gap of two teeth so it can only leave by friction, by bursting bones into bits, child. As an adult, I wake up on the right or wrong side of the bed, never on the curve of the world because they taught me it isn't mine. When the car is parked and the door barely opens, you ask me, hey, can you squeeze through? And I nod, thinking how many times my body, this body, has squeezed through the gaps of closed doors and sentences, has been shoved into tight hallways, has been pushed into construction sites. Now, now the moon transitions in lunar phases. She, I, we are the only ones left choking on clouds. Thank you. <laughs>